Hey everyone, it is a Sunday afternoon and we are just headed out for a little spring session. So we've got onto our first one. Hopefully we get a few more and we're gonna cook up some dinner on the boat this afternoon before heading back in. So just a quick one today and hoping we can get on a couple more of these bad boys. It's so hard because you want to get excited and just rip them in, but you have to bring them in so slow. on by one tentacle. He doesn't want to get caught, that's for sure. That is a big sucker. It's a big squid. All right, guys, second squid on board. I did lose one after that first one, but he is a massive one. Super happy with him. Um, so we're going to put him away. He might be our dinner tonight, but he put up a good fight. It's awesome fun catching them. that's number three we're gonna chuck him away we're gonna do about half an hour more of squidding and then we're gonna get into cooking up some delicious squid for dinner So I'm just about to start cleaning the squid for dinner and Rowan is going to use a tentacle to try and catch us a fish because we brought everything for fish wraps except we don't have any fish so hopefully he can get one. Fish on the up. This feels a bit more capable. Right in the nick of time. Well, it might not, not be any better. Oh, yeah, I reckon he's in. This looks like a much better flag. He'll be close. Okay, there we are. We got dinner. 34 centimeter Spanish flag. He swallowed that hook pretty deep, so. He'll definitely be going away in the frying pan. Just got Eden setting up over here, starting to cook up on the squid. Got the camera going. So my job now is to clean this guy up after all of that. left this hanging over the back for a second more. It feels like I've got a pretty good fish on here. It is a cod, is it? Yeah. All right, Eden's just cooking up over there. I've just pulled in a decent little orange spot cod. We don't want this guy though, so I'm gonna unhook him. I'm gonna throw this guy back. All 
right guys, so full disclosure, I made a real, real hard effort of that to get that fish. So Eden's just cooking up the Spanish flag right now. It was actually really difficult for me to get against all things, right when you want to get a fish on sunset and it should only take you five minutes. So it took me probably 20 minutes to get it. So we just didn't want to lose light there that you can see. Eden's doing a ripper job of that. Uh, yeah, so if you've never eaten Spanish flag before, Spanish flag is delicious, especially fresh. Got the fresh cooked squid there. She's pre-packaged everything earlier on today, as far as the fish wraps are concerned. So, got some taco shells here, some soft ones, a few ingredients. Oh, never mind the kids' lunchbox there. Then we're going to get stuck into this. Okay, so I'm just gonna do a quick taste test while Eden makes her wrap there. See what it's good taste like. Could be a little bit more tender, I'm not gonna lie. That wasn't my cooking to be fair. Why not? When you catch it fresh, it's nowhere near as tender. Like, when you catch squid, squid always tastes better after it's been frozen. Fresh is not the best way to eat it. So, Eden's blaming the freshness of the squid on the tenderness there, so. <laughs> you're wrong. The only thing we can do next time there, because I've uh, critiqued her cooking and she's not too happy about it, next time we get some fresh squid, I'll do the cook up and I'll see if I can um, nail it myself. We always knew time today was gonna be tight getting out here to do a catch and cook on sunset. So we're just um, off Dampier Archipelago today, which is our home set of islands, not far from us. Eden's made a wrap there. And we didn't actually leave until the afternoon. And the reason we didn't do any adventuring today is because I love watching the UFC in my spare time. So whenever there's a good card on, I don't find myself out on the boat until that's over. So about two o'clock today, we started getting the boat ready once we saw the main fights and then we've come out on the water just for a nice sunset, drop with the wind in the afternoon and Eden's done pretty good. She's uh, caught some really big squid there. I was fiddling around with the camera all day. I didn't even catch a single squid. So with all that we managed to get though, with the drones and these shots and everything amongst the rush of time, I hope this video's turned out pretty good with the footage. So. We'll see what Eden reckons of her Spanish flag wrap here. Delicious. All right, so there's my fish wrap slash taco. Everyone's got a secret ingredient to make their things uh, the best. For us, it's this right here. Coconut sriracha. Never mind Eden eating in the background there, she feels a bit humiliated, but yeah, that one there, coconut sriracha. We swear by this, that's probably the best sauce we've found to go with any of our seafood that we eat. Alright guys, we're going to wrap this video up here for today. Just a quick Sunday afternoon squidding session and a catch and cook out on the boat. Just thought we'd do it for something different, keep it easy, we didn't have to uh, cook dinner at home tonight, so we're well fed. Had the Spanish flag fish wraps, nice and fresh, and the flowered calamari. Both tasted great. So we're gonna wrap that one here before we run out of sunlight. So we've got a beautiful sunset happening over there. And we're gonna head on home before it gets too dark and make sure we don't hit any reefs. So thanks for watching and we'll see you guys in the next video.